So guys, a quick video. Many say that uh, Panasonic autofocus sucks and uh, many say that uh, Panasonic G85, G80 autofocus sucks. Well, the, the reason uh, why it sucks it is because you do not set the autofocus correctly. So basically there are few steps to set it up in order to work much better. It will not be uh, perfect like the Sony R, like Sony autofocus is the best on the market. However, uh, I already saw you in previous videos how I film myself with uh, the Panasonic uh, G85, G80, mice G80 because it's European version. So it is all the time in focus. The things what I do it is to set the um, face picture of yours. So basically inside the camera there is a option that uh, it said about a um, face um, kind of face recognition. So you have to choose that option from, from there. You have to make a picture and uh, save it inside your profile so the camera can recognize you all the time. You can also name it as I did for mine. So all the time when the camera recognizes my face uh, it's written my name Stella. And um, I'm shooting on a face detection um, um, autofocus which you can choose from inside the various uh, autofocus uh, types um, inside the autofocus uh, menu. Uh, so choose face recognition. Uh, it is the first one in the row. It is not recognition but the face detection something like this. And um, um, on here on the on the dial on not on the dial but on the close to the dial you have to choose AFS. So I'm not choosing the continuous autofocus, I just choose the S. So it works how you can see it now. So this is the autofocus from the G80, G85. <laughs> so um, as you can see it works beautifully. Uh, also some uh, people on YouTube said, made a test and uh, said that it works a little bit better in uh, Full HD than in 4K. Guys, I've shot tons of video in, in one month and one month and a half since I have my camera. I've shot like really a lot, a lot, a lot of videos for all my YouTube channels. I have six YouTube channels and um, I do also a uh, film right now, a documentary. So I'm shooting a lot. And I've tried all the three profiles, like not profiles, but uh, um, I've shot in uh, 4K and uh, Full HD. Right now I'm, I'm shooting in Full HD, uh, 25p and I've shoot also in HD and the autofocus works beautifully with all this uh, video modes in 4K, in Full HD and in HD. It works like almost perfect, almost perfect. Um, maybe because I'm using this lens, who knows, I don't know, really. Like, I'm using, um, yeah, the white balance is set on the cloud, so that's why you see me yellow. But if I will, uh, where is the white balance? I cannot change it now. Uh, anyways, I cannot change the white balance. Uh, while the camera is going. Um, however, it is. I'm yellow because I've said it before 
and I forgot to set it now. Uh, yeah, I've done that with this. So basically, as you can see, it works beautifully. The autofocus follows me really good without any problems. And um, I'm uh, right now in a vlogging style, as you can see. It is the camera, it is on my uh, small tripod. Um, tripod the um, like rig I would say uh, it's really hard for me to keep it because uh, my back is hurt so um, yeah so it is a vlogging style right now and I can say firmly that this camera is great for vlogging like right now I'm 10 centimeters from the lens and um, it keeps me in focus and uh, everything works beautifully. So it's a wonderful camera for vlogging, vlogging if you need. And I'm using it like maybe 50% of the time or most percent, more percent of the time I use this camera for vlogging. Um, yeah, um, it works beautifully. As you can see, the autofocus works really, really well. I can do also like this. So I can make it right now on 25 millimeters. So this is the 25 millimeters. Um, maybe I have like this to, to, to set it, but it is really hard to, to keep it, guys, because it's I cannot lift lift uh, weights. <laughs> it is hard to, to to have it. Maybe I will, I will stay like this a little bit. Oh my god! <laughs> so um, yeah, but it's not enough light. Oh, so this is 25 millimeters. So it's equivalent of the 50 millimeters. As you can see, it works beautifully. Everything. Yeah, I, I have to hold it like this. So because the focal length and um, the, the minimal uh, focusing distance is uh, a little bit more from the uh, 25 millimeters instead of uh, 14 millimeters <laughs> and also I have this one so as you can see everything works beautifully everything is in focus so this is the test that um, I wanted to show you and uh, I believe it's important because it shows the camera in action and then um, it shows that the autofocus works works beautifully without any problems and you can use it all the time you want for your works hopefully um, you like this video and uh, it makes some sense for you like if we your camera does not work in autofocus mode just change your lens get a Suiko kit lens and it will work beautifully bye bye